Would you care to ponder the importance of preserving the memory of, uh, of older and deceased relatives and ancestors? I think it's very important that, you know, that's the way I feel about things. I, I think um, I've always wanted to know how to keep in touch with family, you know, I, um, and I suppose I've been the one in our family who's done that a lot, to try and keep in touch with family members across the globe. I think it's really important to know something of the history of one's family, sort of what made them tick, where they came from, what interested them, how their lives panned out, you know. Um, I, I just like it. I mean, I know there are plenty of people who, there's nothing the matter with it. It's, it's just the way you feel about things, but there are people who are just not particularly... They could take it or leave it, you know. If you mention a name, they say, oh, who was that? Or if they even do say that. Not particularly bothered about knowing anything of the past, but I always, I like it very much. I like to know who came from where and perhaps why they came. Well, in most instances, one knew why they came originally. But... Uh, it's always been, if you like, a hobby of mine. <laughs> and I suppose it will remain that way for as long as I can, you know, keep in touch with people I will always want to. Hobby of yours to remember birthdays? Oh, it's a hobby of mine to remember birthdays, yes. I remember many, many, many birthdays, don't I? Because I think people like to be thought of. And knowing that it, it's of interest to somebody to know how they're feeling and that they're, they're around and that they exist and that this is their special day. Birthdays just hop into my mind. It's of really no, no difficulty for me to remember them. They're just, I say, ah, oh, yes, May. And then straight away I can see the, the birthdays that run through that month or whichever month it is, it makes no difference. <laughs>